Bob Wagner. Welcome to my lovely city of Charleston, South Carolina. But you know what? It didn't all start out for me here. I'm originally from Los Angeles. And then at 17, found my way into a kitchen. The chef of that restaurant found me another job in Hollywood. That chef wanted me to go to France. And I figured, what the heck? I'll spend a year learning how to cook in France. I did, but I came back 11 years later after working with some of the top two and three star Michelin chefs. Came back, I actually had my own restaurant in France for three years also, but now back in Charleston after 12 years, I have two new television shows coming out. You Cook with Chef Bob and You Travel with Chef Bob. Here's a little insight as to what's happening in my life now. Sit back, pour yourself another limoncello and watch with me 30 years of past, present and future of Bob Wagner with the help of my good buddy, Carlos, the guitarist. First time that I met you, I knew I'd not forget you. Be dreaming about you all through the night. Your eyes, they burn right through me, and your smile simply move me. You're forever, ever, ever in my heart. But for dreams to fly, they gotta be high. Yeah, for dreams. first time that I kissed you, I knew I'd always miss you. If you were not there standing by my side. So I got myself the courage and I asked you for marriage. And you looked at me as if I've lost my mind. But for dreams to fly, you gotta be high. Yeah, for dreams. The first time that I met you, I knew I'd not forget you. Be dreaming about you all through the night. So I got myself the courage and I asked you for marriage. And you looked at me as if I've lost my mind forever in my heart. over real quick what all our little ingredients are that we have going on here. Uh -huh. Got some corn, got some little pea shoots. Have you ever seen, uh, that, that's the beginning plant of a little snow pea. I learned about that in biology, you know, X, <laughs> X, X, Y, when you did the peas together to get the traits. That's what they were. <laughs> and you had pea shoots like this? Uh-huh. What grade was that? No, that was college. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is good, we're gonna get through. This is our second ingredient, Lynn. We haven't even gotten through the ingredients yet. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, if that doesn't set up for a standing ovation that we've never had on this show, Lynn's pork tenderloin.